last week we learned about the ministry of Christ through the body of Christ. We're all on this road, going on this journey together. We have a oneness, but we all have individual gifts. Jesus is the giver of those gifts, as we know. You know, traditionally a victor, someone who has defeated things, would march through the city and then people would throw gifts out at their feet and they would lavish upon them these wonderful gifts. But in Jesus' upside down kingdom, he does the opposite. He is the one that gives out gifts. He, he distributes them to all the people. It's wonderful. It, you know, I think about this box here on page 37 in 2.1. It says, it is the work of Christ, right? that life, death, or resurrection, that releases us to be who God has originally designed us to be. We hearken back and think about Genesis 1 when we were in the garden with him. He then he takes these things that are already present within us and he redeems them and he realigns them for his own purposes and then he gives us new direction and significance. When we look at a reflection, we don't get to decide what's there in this mirror. We just get to discover it. To look upon what God has already designed and made us. That's our spiritual identity. And then it is these gifts. Evangelists, prophets, apostles, shepherds, teachers. These are the gifts that he has given us on the lifelong journey. Our vocational identity. Well, thanks, Andy. So this week... That's what we're going to do. Not only are we looking at ourselves and the gifts that God has given to us, but we're looking at each other. You've taken some time this week, hopefully, to fill out what you have seen in other people. Now, we're going to do this kindly and graciously because we're trying to build each other up, not tear each other down. But go ahead in your groups and discuss what you see as gifts in other people. I'm excited to see what we discover together. All right. Take care. See you in the future.